Hey guys, you know it's another episode of Lucian Act. That's right, okay. I know it's been a very long time, but today I'm gonna give you guys something very simple, one minute, a one re, one minute recipe, okay, a vanilla ice cream recipe. I know it's been a long time. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, okay. Hope you let's make some vanilla ice cream. My goodness. So first off, what we're gonna start with is 600 milliliters of milk and also 600 milliliters of cream, okay? We're gonna add everything together to one pot. Then from there, we're gonna split our vanilla bean in half. Vanilla beans are very expensive. You can get them, it's okay. Just use vanilla extract, okay? So you're gonna scrape up the center, scrape up the, the beans. You're gonna add that to the milk and cream mixture. Scrape it into the pot. Also, we're gonna use our stock we're gonna cut it up okay don't waste anything there's still a lot of flavor in there okay then we're gonna heat it up okay you don't want to maybe to around 70 80 degrees you don't want it boiling okay once you see bubbles start forming to the side you take it off while that's heating up we're gonna separate our egg yolks from our egg whites because we need about five egg yolks five, five large egg yolks for this particular recipe so there are two techniques you could use your hands which i think is much better you can get more egg white out or you could use the shell okay you do it one by one you just keep on adding it adding it adding it okay while you scrape off more and more egg whites whichever you prefer okay then we're gonna weigh out um 230 grams of sugar okay then we're gonna this little technique is very useful okay to balance off your bowl if you can't use both of your hands okay so you can't hold it down properly this will really help so now we're gonna whisk our egg yolks and our sugar we're gonna whip it till it gets fluffy we want that kind of consistency as you can see in the video we're gonna use this okay keep on whipping keep on whipping okay then we're gonna check on our milk okay once the temperature is up there we're gonna scoop off the vanilla stalks okay the pieces of pot we chopped up then we're gonna add that into our egg yolk and sugar mixture so while you add you whisk okay that's why I showed you guys the cloth technique this really helps okay then when you're done whisking what we're gonna do we're gonna add everything back into that same pot okay and make sure when you're adding it back you scrape off every single every bit of sugar or egg yolk or whatever may be left in the bowl we want zero wastage okay we want to use everything we want to make sure everything is incorporated properly okay then we're gonna whisk we're gonna whisk until it starts to fluff up you'll see it starts to thicken but you don't want it boiling if it boils it can cause your 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 custard to split okay your creme anglaise your ice cream base to split then to that we're gonna add about 10 grams of xanthan gum xanthan gum you may be it may be difficult to find but it's not necessary i just like to use it because it helps stabilize the base okay kind of thicken it thickens it up a bit and also holds it together a bit more that's why i like to use it but you can also use something called super neutrals but that's again a bit hard to find so it's not necessary if you don't have it okay and then we're gonna get our bowl we're gonna put it over some ice water and you're gonna strain that mixture okay we're gonna strain that base so what we're gonna do we're gonna make sure everything is nice and and smooth we're gonna make sure you get off get rid of any lumps anything that may be hanging there you're going to use this technique to kind of help you cool off your sauce a bit quicker okay it kind of separates what's making contact with the cold wall of the bowl okay then what we're going to do we're going to add this into our ice cream maker okay our our sauce we're going to add it to our ice cream maker but if you don't have an ice cream maker don't worry we have another technique we can show you okay so we're going to let that go for about 20 to 30 minutes okay and slowly and slowly it'll start to thicken up it'll start to get more and more frozen and you can decide whatever texture you like or or prefer okay then we're gonna keep keep on keep keep an eye on your on your ice cream machine okay you can keep on checking and see what kind of texture it has so for the other technique we're gonna get a ziploc bag we're gonna add some salt and to the salt we're gonna add our ice cubes then we're gonna put the rest of our ice cream mixture into another ziploc bag and then we're going to put that inside the ziploc bag then we're going to add a little bit of water just a little bit okay and then we're just going to shake and shake and shake and shake and eh, and shake and shake and eh, okay so if you're feeling guilty for eating ice cream don't don't worry this will give you a nice workout so you'll burn off all the cal calories you may get from eating the ice cream <laughs> so you need to shake for maybe 10 to 15 minutes okay maybe not that long but 
it's very tiring it may seem that way okay so then when you you see it starts to thicken up you can test open up see what kind of texture it, it is and then have a taste test and see what exactly is missing and what you may need to add okay but it seems perfect and you know i approve so we have our cones you know get your cone see how lovely that is soft serve so there you have it you have your nice soft serve vanilla ice cream we're gonna let it go longer if you want it a bit more thicker okay so let's have a taste oh wait wait wait, wait, wait. you know illusion acts we have to bless the food first so the verse of today is john chapter 6 verse 35 it says then jesus said i am the bread of life whoever comes to me will never go hungry and whoever believes in me will never be thirsty okay now i understand why i'm never hungry or never thirsty that's why i get fat okay so i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to like share subscribe